everyone no this isn't a backdrop it's just my closet doors I figured it would be a lot easier to show you my haircut against a white background instead of you know my typical background so that's what I'm going to be doing today I'm going to be talking about my latest haircut if you've been following my channel for a while then you know I'm very keen to the bob haircut before I did the pixie I had a bob and I've had the bob a ton of times during my lifetime I that's just kind of like my go-to haircut I love experimenting with different like types of bobs like more textured bobs straight blunt bob I've even got my hair chemically straightened and I got a bob so I've done a lot of different variations of the bob but this is my latest my latest bob <laughs> so I got it cut maybe two or even three weeks ago and usually when I do these type of hair videos I do it right after I got my hair cut but it's been a while so my hair has grown out a tiny bit the bangs definitely grew out so I had to trim them myself and also the undercut has grown out a little bit so it's not the ideal my ideal way of talking about hair but let's work with it so I got a asymmetrical textured bob this time I know quite <laughs> it sounds quite fancy but it's really not all that complicated so instead of getting a blunt bob I asked for textures like I did in my last bob but my hairstylist suggested to get an asymmetrical type of look so if you can see this is way longer than this side it just makes it a little bit more fun in my opinion and also when you add a lot of texturizing spray or texturizing products it kind of highlights it it just looks a lot more playful a lot more modern in my opinion apart from the asymmetrical aspect to my haircut I also got layers just to make it a little bit more choppy a little bit more textured and this works really well if you do have naturally wavy or curly hair so I have shorter layers up at the top as you can see and then it gets longer and longer at the bottom so what that does is it creates very fun lived-in texture which I am all about and the most obvious change is of course the bangs the bangs <laughs> I've had bangs for years and years and years. I probably did bangs for around seven or eight years straight and then once I grew out my hair from a pixie cut I just grew out my bangs and I've had no bangs for around two years. I just got really bored of not having bangs like this is just my look. <laughs> so I got the bangs again and I did trim my bangs recently so they're a little bit shorter than my hairstylist actually did on me but I kind of like this style a lot better. It's just short. I can you know show off my eyebrows <laughs> and it's just a lot easier to manage and I spoke about this on my snapchat. I thought I was going to have a harder time like rocking the bangs now that I'm not like straightening my hair every single day because when I used to have bangs in high school and in college I would straighten them every single morning every single day I would straighten my bangs and I thought that was the only way to have bangs if you have naturally wavy or curly hair back then I thought that was the only way you could have bangs I would straighten the shit out of them but now I just let them air dry I like just brush them forward put a little bit of product and that's it and this is just how my bangs look like when they're air dry. Some people will have curlier bangs than others. If I do let them grow out a little bit like my hairstylist did, they were curling a little bit more. But if I keep them just short like this, then this is how they look like when they're air dried. So it's so cool. I really, really love them. And like this hair just feels very healthy <laughs> when compared to the past when I would straighten the hell out of them. But I just really love the bangs. And this is probably my favorite thing about the haircut is having bangs again just because I feel like my old self. This haircut and the bangs have just been a really nice throwback. I kind of feel like myself when I was in high school or like the beginning of college when it was a little bit more carefree because this year as you guys know has been very challenging for me but at least I'm embracing you know the shorter hair again the bangs and that's making life a little bit more fun which is always good I did record a few clips from my haircut appointment so I will insert them right here it was just on snapchat <laughs> it had been a while since I have seen my hairdresser so we honestly spent the whole time just catching up and talking and stuff and when I get my haircut it's kind of like a little bit of a therapy session or just like a catching up with a friend type of deal so it's just not the most ideal situation to bring in my DSLR my tripod and everything and it's a little bit cramped 
so yeah I just I don't know I still haven't <laughs> decided on you know documenting the whole haircut experience maybe once I do I will have to talk with her maybe just doing it in my house or somewhere else where I don't have to bother other people and there's not a lot of background music playing and all that stuff so maybe I'll have to work something out with her <laughs> in order to document my haircut and that's pretty much it for this video and also me talking about my hair I absolutely love this haircut and it feels so nice to have my bangs back I just miss them so much if you live in the San Diego area I will be leaving the salon information as well as my hairdressers information in the comments below she just made a brand new Instagram for all her hair work so I will link that in the information bar below and if you want to get a haircut let me know what type of haircut you want in the comments below I would love to chat with you and if you're brand new to this channel don't forget to subscribe by clicking right over here or down below help me reach 10,000 subscribers and before I forget I do have reference pictures of this haircut on my blog post I will link it down below in the information box for you to check out and if you do like this haircut you can bring it to your own hairdresser so you can get this this haircut on my head <laughs> so thank you guys so much once again for watching this video and I'll see you guys very soon on Sunday with a brand new video take care Bye! This eye cream is also suited for all skin types, so it doesn't matter if you have dry skin, normal skin, combination skin, oily skin like myself, and I have really oily skin, like oily all over.